you do that on purpose now. I'm doing that on purpose. Hey guys, good morning. So this is our first day um, without guests. And it's just really different. Um, it's been nice having family visit, but it's always nice to get back into your own routine as well. Uh, so it's just a little different this morning. Um, so Hubby and I are getting up. We're starting off the day. I should probably keep doing my hair so I don't talk to y'all looking mad. So we can start the day off by doing one of the things we typically do in a part of our routine and it's going for walks and it doesn't sound like it's that it's something super extravagant and it doesn't sound like something impossible to do when there are guests here but it was actually really hard trying to get that um done while we had guests here i've also been neglecting my hair it's just between being pregnant and tired I've washed it I keep washing it and then I keep saying I'm gonna put it in this style and so I keep washing it to prepare it because I hate doing my I'm not gonna go do my hair when you know when my hair is dirty so I keep washing it and prepping it to do something and then it just sits there again in a couple corners underneath my wig and that's how it remains until I'm back at this stage so I was wearing a cap on it the past couple of days in between alternating for my wig and I'm just like okay I gotta stop and comb it out before all my hair falls out because it's getting super dry <laughs> so this is what I'm working with this hat has the clip what do you call it the section that you just pull your ponytail through so and I like that Keep the bump, y'all. <laughs> I'm in the girls' bathroom, like I said. This is the belly. Over the weekend, I was feeling so bloated. Oh my goodness. But it's good to see that, you know, sometimes it's just like air and fluids, water retention. Because I'm starting to feel much more like my natural self. I gained 30 pounds, but I don't see, you know, overall, I think it's looking pretty good. Like, I don't feel like it's everywhere I don't some when I'm not dressing the part and I'm not wearing like a proper you know bra when I'm not wearing a proper bra or just you know dress proper it just everything just feels so spread out you just feel so much bigger and look so much bigger but when I do put myself together <laughs> at least you know like this because I'm just running on the street not going anywhere special I definitely I feel good I feel good and I am approaching my 28 weeks, which only leaves me at 10 weeks to go because I'm having a C-section. This is the, my birth plan. And it's not, well, it's not my birth plan by choice. It's the birth plan that's kind of been stuck since the first time when they um, gave me a C-section. It's, it's been inevitable that I will have a C-section going forward especially after you've had many and I've had three and then four and now this baby this little one will be delivered via um, c-section so that is my birth the birth plan and because I do have big babies because I do have gestational diabetes they do schedule me two weeks early so I already have a date for the baby um, I already have a date for him uh, he is gonna be born about two weeks early according to the cesarean plan and yeah so I already have that date and that being said when I reach 28 weeks I'll only have 10 weeks to go 28 weeks will be approaching in just a number of days and then yeah literally two and a half months to go and I know it's gonna go by fast because I have a lot of plans <laughs> a lot of things to get done in that time frame so yeah bad wolf <gasps> and she remembered the warnings about the big bad wolf in the forest and to never trust him. Right? So she saw the sign to Granny's house and she went that way because she wanted to get to Granny's house as fast as possible. Now, 
the big bad wolf, he was tricky. And he saw that Little Red Riding Hood was going the right way. But he wanted to eat Little Red Riding Hood. Oh, what a naughty wolf. So he caught up to her and said, Little Red Riding Hood, do you want a faster way to Granny's house? And Little Red Riding Hood thought and said, mm, Aren't you the big bad wolf? And he said, No, that's my brother. I'm the good, good wolf. I'm the big, good wolf. That's right. That makes sense. The bad wolf. And he said, Oh, is he? Yeah. Oh, but he told Little Red Riding Hood that he's the big, good wolf. And she said, Oh, okay. If you're a good wolf, then you would help me. And he said, Yes, let me show you a shortcut. So he showed her a shortcut, which is really a longer way to get to Granny's house. And she took that path. <gasps> so she was going to take longer to get to Granny's house. You guys, so peep my living room right now. I know you guys could glimpse the footage of that. But yesterday you would have seen that I was, was taking, I took off all the covers of my cushion. There's like little stains and stuff on there that I wanted to just get out. And it's just that time. I also swiffered my floor. I've been just kind of taking a big, you know, break and it's just that time to just get some of my cleaning done. Obviously now that like our guests are gone, it's easier to do that stuff because you just want to like, you know, accommodate and just, and you know, enjoy the time and not focus so much on just like cleaning and getting all the stuff done. You know, you can, so that's what we did. To, the cushions are now washed. They are to come out of the, they're, they're already dried actually. They should come out. <laughs> um, I put them on yesterday. I put them on to dry once, and I think when hubby went to check them, they weren't dry, right? You had to put them on a second time? Yeah, yeah they were both dry. I get nervous about putting them on a second time because they're like that fabric, and I'm just like, I cannot afford for them to shrink. But, I mean, it's a cushion. They well, they should fit back in. But it's nice that they can come off. I just wish the backs could come off, too. You have to just kind of clean the backs with a, a wash, like a towel or with a little soap. But... My fear is that then the soap won't come out. So yeah. overall, I think we haven't even owned them for a year yet. So overall, I think what we're going to have done soon is just some steam cleaning. It's just been, we've had a lot of guests and we've had a lot of people and stuff on there over the last while, which is perfectly fine. It's just what we bought it for. But I think to maintain it ourselves, we're either going to buy a steamer, which I've checked out on Amazon. It's actually a really good price, like a hundred and something dollars to st for a steamer that everyone said is pretty good. It's got like amazing ratings and it, um, it can steam and clean the couch. I just want to make sure if I get it, we're going to use it and we're going to do a good job. I've never checked out a steaming company, but I've seen other vloggers do have. And I mean, that's in the US, so I don't know the comp the price comparison. But I think the companies, they know what they're doing. For us, it will be trial and error. Yeah, leave a comment down below and let me know if you've ever steamed your whole, your whole couch. I think when you steam it, it, you can't sit on it for like eight hours and that's a long time it's gonna be hard for us because it's our family room luckily we do have another living room but this is uh oh did you bite your tongue uh oh, oh I think she bit she her bit tongue, tongue when she oh let me see let me see oh let me see you bit your tongue when you sneezed oh it's okay give me a kiss oh, oh you'll be okay oh it's okay. Oh, sit. Go play with daddy. Oh, <laughs> you're okay. Good girl. Oh, my goodness. Oh, you're okay, mama. But I was saying, um, from what I've heard, when you steam your couches, you have to kind of leave it for eight hours. Luckily, we do have um, another room, like our, our formal sitting room, which we are in all the time anyways. But this is where the TV room is, and so we wouldn't be able to use the TV for maybe eight hours. I don't know how that would work. So you guys, we are back now guys from our walk. Um, did you have a good walk, Aaron? Oh yes, it was good. How long, how long did we walk for? Oh, so daddy. Half an hour. Are you eating? 40 minutes. Right? Yeah. 
yeah i think we walked for about 40 minutes then we took zoe to the park which was really fun she had a great time what did you do at the park mama i fly down the cake you did was it fun yeah did you slide with rainbow dash yeah. and twilight sparkle yeah. that's right oh, oh your yogurt is all done <laughs> now um the girls we came back and the girls are all awake so now we're back and the girls are all awake so we're gonna go did you see outside did you see how dark it just got whoa everyone's awake now uh-huh okay are you, what are you guys triplets today they're all wearing the same shorts oh yeah i don't know why i just want to go shorts too <laughs> okay so we're gonna go get something to eat because like i mentioned it's labor day and we don't have we have food in here no but food. I don't know if we have food to really make, and I'm not in the mood to go make anything. So I'm just gonna go have, get something real quick on the street, and then we're, we're gonna go because it does look like it's gonna thunderstorm. Aaron thought it wasn't going to, but it looks like it is. Look at it. Yeah, again. it's gonna thunderstorm. Say hi sure. to the vlog. Hey guys, it's gonna thunderstorm. I gotta mow my lawn. Can you come say hi for a second? No. Just touch base. Hi, is everyone? Hey guys. Can you see how fat my face has gotten? Oh, babes, come on, honey. I love your chubby face. <laughs> <laughs> the pregnancy face. Yeah, come on. Don't be hard on yourself, honey. Is if your it, face didn't it? chubby up, would you kind of be concerned that it didn't? No. You'd like my face hasn't not. changed. No, I would is not. This is healthy. <laughs> no, I would not. No. Yes, you would. No, I wouldn't. Why would I be concerned about my face getting chubby? That it wasn't chubby. No, I would not. Because mm -hmm. my face is not what's pregnant. You'd be like, I've never looked like this before. Boy, but I yes, would be concerned would. if it was my belly, uh -huh. but no, uh, no. As, <laughs> anyways, yeah, guys. She's gonna I go can, get a sandwich now. I need to go get some food, so let's go. Who's the orange juice? Is that yours and your child's that y'all left out? You left that out? No. So here, you can be the compost man. Do your There's husband, nothing. do the men in your, hus your house do that? Are they the composter? <laughs> There's nothing like warm orange juice. That's gross. Stop. Yeah. Stop. Lots of pulp. Yeah, that one has lots of pulp. It's actually good though. I like the pulp. You want to try No. I don't want to do it. Can I try this? I like a good amount of pulp, but not too much. Does that like, one have uh, a lot of pulp? <laughs> so, <laughs> I don't, I don't so, really shake mine. Because then there's no pulp. Oh, uh, these kids, they think they're so smart. So you, you, so I saw all, the, the all the pulp at the bottom. They're like, uh, no, after it's half done, they're like, uh, let's go to the open <laughs> Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, don't be you? careful. Be careful. No, Anyways, guys, we're going to go grab some food. I'm not sure if there's going to be more to this vlog because we wanted to spend some time today. There uh, was a bit of a surprise. The girls are not starting school for another two weeks, which is really, it's actually really good. I'm, you know, I'm happy for them. They can have a bit of a break because they were doing school when all the other kids were off earlier because they were doing summer school. So that's pretty good. And it's because they're going to be doing virtual learning. Does that mean that Zoe's going to be by herself learning at the table? You're so stupid. Oh, yeah. She's, oh, yeah. That means that she'll have like four teachers at hand. Or three, oh. yeah, four yeah. teachers at hand to be able to teach her. I see. Anyways, Zoe can start school when the girls are starting school. She is legit. I you, Zoe, are you excited to start school? Yeah. What are you going to learn? I'm going to learn teacher. You're going <laughs> to learn from your teacher? You're going to learn from your teacher? Yeah. You're going to learn your ABCs? Yeah. And your one, two, threes? Yeah. She already knows those. Yeah. <laughs> are you going to learn how to spell your name? Yeah. Spell your name. Can. Yes, you oh, do. You I do know how. <laughs> Remember? It's Z O E. Zoe. Spell your name. I can't. <laughs> 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 you do that on purpose now. I'm doing that on purpose. Can you try? Okay, try it for me. Look at me. Z O E. Zoe. You Yay. try. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> you are so sweet. Are you going to teach your brother everything too? Are you going to be a teacher as well? You're going to teach him how to count because you know how to count. And you know That's your that. alphabet too. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I did an alphabet on the TV. Oh, That's you did right. the alphabet on the TV? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Remember when you used to practice? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, guys, your girl is hungry, hungry, hungry. I mean, the boy is hungry, hungry, hungry. hungry. <laughs> Hungry, hungry, what hungry. are all oh <laughs> <laughs> these, these kids? They're making so much fun of me. Mm -mm.